Hey guys, be sure to like and subscribe. We're walking up the opposite street that we usually walk to go into town. So we're heading away from town now. Um, you guys have seen the other, the other way. So I thought I'd take you down this way and show you what's going on here. It's a lot of new stores because the town is kind of spreading out a little bit. And you can see we got some old buildings down this way. This build, this way here is just starting to get rejuvenated, I'll say. You know? And it's starting to catch up a little bit, which is good. So rather than seeing empty buildings and buildings like these here over here that are kind of falling apart and stuff like that, they're starting to fix them up. And they got some nice houses down here too. But you can see across the street there, they're doing some work. And a lot of work going down this way. They got a brand new Alpha Mart here, which is kind of cool. I didn't know this was here. This is interesting. So this is actually new for me too, guys. I never come down this way. There's an alley down there with a house down there. This is, today's Sunday, so you're gonna see a lot of stores close. It's not that they're usually closed, it's just that today is Sunday. Okay? Now here's a, a college here. Okay, I'll let you take a look at the sign here for you guys. That, some of you guys were asking about college over here for your kids and stuff like that. But that's the admission requirements and stuff. Okay? We have a lot, a lot of nice little places here that I haven't even been aware of. The Amore International School, okay? Nursery, school kindergarten. Um, so this is just like a high school grade, nursery through um, grade 10, I guess. No, all the way up to grade 12, I guess. It's a big school. And you can see the school here. I'm looking way, way up. Bachelor of Science in Business Administration. Okay, um, kind of cool. You know, I didn't know this was here. I've never really walked down this far. So this is all new. Even though I've lived here this long, I've never been down this way. Except driving past it and stuff like that. So I didn't really pay attention because when you're driving in a jeepney, you can't see anything. Is Pappy's American Burger and the water market and as you can see they're starting to fix up some places over here and they're doing a lot of uh, infrastructure work too so it's kind of nice and looks like they're trying to build something here maybe a medical facility Let's see. It says Metro Tracy Trading Corporation. I'm not sure what if what that is. And it's got the curfew hours. Here's a gas station, sea oil. Never heard of that one before. It's a new one on me. Never heard of sea oil. And I've driven around here quite a lot with friends and stuff. There's a machine shop. This is something new I haven't seen. Guess I need to get out more. That's some old housing or no I guess it's a shop Alcano's motorcycle parts right here <laughs> living water is a water place
doing some work here too, guys. This is kind of fascinating that this is becoming a big part of town now. The Philippines is on the move. It's really growing fast in some areas. In some places it's getting poorer, in some places it's getting better. It's funny because you go into the malls, a lot of the stores are closing, but you come down here and you see all this place, these places popping up here. It's amazing. This is a construction site, pretty big. Missionaries of Charity Brothers. It's got a picture of what looks like Mother Teresa on there. Home for the Special Abandoned Children. That's awesome. I didn't know that that was there. I might actually go in there and check that out. That might be something I might want to help out with. It's kind of cool. It looks like a house behind here. But it's hard to tell. We'll see what the front looks like down here. Yeah, it seems like it's a really well-to-do house. But cassava cake. There we go. All right, now it's time to break up into houses and stuff. Luigi's baking, cooking, and packing. And now we're starting to get into houses and stuff. I'll walk up a little bit more and see what's up here. I don't think there's much more up here. Fuel Express here. And we got a car wash across the street here. Yeah, it looks like it's all forest from here on up, guys, except for a few houses up there sprinkled in and out, but no businesses or anything, really. But you can see from here on up, it's all just mostly forest. There's a few small businesses up there, but nothing much. So I'm going to end up going back here, guys. What I'm going to do is I'll cut across to the other side, and we'll get on this side. And we'll see what's going on over here. You can see how the other side lives now. If you want, if you want to watch this half of the video, <laughs> just kind of cool. There's a little store. I'll just do a little bit of this side, guys. Just want to show you. Looks like a house here. I don't know why he's riding on the wrong side of the road. I just want to show you some of the signs here, what they got here. That's the place for the abandoned children. I'm gonna end it here, guys. I just thought that'd be kind of cool though, but here's the home for abandoned children up this way. So, kind of interesting. I'll have to check that out. But anyway, guys, God bless, take care, and be sure to like and subscribe, guys.